Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. <laughs> I'm doing quite a few sit down videos recently and I absolutely love that for me because I feel like I got in the habit of vlog, vlog, vlog. But like there's more to talk about than vlog. Although I do have a vlog dropping this week, which you should have watched, which is a week of my life and I go to so many different places. But that's not what we're here to talk about. We're here to talk about me moving to America. <sighs> I can't believe I'm even saying this right now. Yeah, so we're talking about me moving to America, which I actually can't even believe. Um, I've been waiting for this moment for 10 years, literally, and you're probably thinking, like, what the heck is she talking about? So, I've written down the notes on my phone of what order we're gonna discuss me moving to America for, but, it is quite daunting, but I'm here to share it with you all guys, the cat's out of the bag. Well, I don't know when I'm going to post this because I've been having mixed reviews from my family and friends of when I should announce it before I leave or whilst I'm in America. But either way, if you're watching it before or after, I'm going, or I'm gone, or I'm there. I don't know. <laughs> Who is going to America with Miss Baby Carrington? Because I'm a baby. If you don't know, I'm actually the baby, like. I will cry at the smallest things ever. I will complain at the smallest things ever. I'm the baby of everything. Like, I might be the fourth child of six, but I'm the baby, like, I don't really get that. <laughs> princess, princess treatment, baby treatment, that's where I reside. Anywho, I'm rambling, I'm like rambling. I am going to America by myself and I'm flying by myself, which is very daunting. Considering I've never flown by myself before. Like I've flown to America before without my mum, but I was like with my school. We went to New York in 2018. But I was with my school, I was with my friends, like it was different. This time I'm flying to America, an eight hour flight to USA on my ones. Why am I being allowed to do this? I'm actually a child. I'm actually a, a 16 year old child. Like, what's so crazy? I don't see myself as a 20 year old. I see myself younger than I am. So when I do these things, I'm like, raw, like, kind of like, you're like five. <laughs> My flight has been booked for a month. I'm going. Oh, gosh. I'm going to California. California girls are unforget- I think my voice sounds really dry recently. I don't know why, but it does. Um, I'm going to California. It's California king bed. Has my voice got deeper? I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> I'm going to San Francisco in California. I've never been to California and I've never been to San Francisco. And I also didn't know that San Francisco is in California. Anyway, like clearly my geography is off scale. I literally thought San Francisco was in San Francisco. I thought, I thought California was basically just LA and Calabasas. So clearly, I shouldn't be going there, I don't know where I'm going. <laughs> I'm going for like two months in the next few weeks. I'm not gonna say when I'm going exactly, just because I don't want no bad man, wicked them, evil them, evil eye, red eye, crosses people for, but wish bad on my plane, like, no, like, no, like, no, that's not what we're gonna do. I'm gonna have a safe flight in God's name and reach in a one piece. Amen. So you might now be wondering how is Carrington getting to America, who she's staying with, what's she doing and why is she going? Well, luckily I'm Carrington so I can tell you why, who, what, where, when, why, why. <laughs> so I'm going to America to be in a camp. So I'm basically doing Camp America. So if you've watched Parent Trap or you've watched camp rock you will know like that kind of vibe i'm going to be a camp counselor at a camp in america i don't think i'm going to say what camp yet once again just because um safety reasons <laughs> the reason why i'm going is my sister went to camp when i was 10 
So about about ten or nine years ago or so, she went to camp as a counsellor. She went to Boston, and I wanted to go so bad. Like I was like, this is what I want to do. But I wanted to be the camp child. Like, mommy, I'm going to camp this summer. Like, blah blah blah. blah. But it's a bit different from when you're um, living in London and you can't exactly send your child to camp because if you send your child to camp you're paying for your child to go to camp if you work at camp you're getting paid to be there so it's a different situation so we was actually at um dinner for my mum's birthday and my sister bianca was like you should go to camp america and i was like um no like no but i always wanted to go but i never thought that i would actually get the chance to go like it's something you know when like you just want to do something but you never think that you would be the person that would get the chance to do it i'm the person that's getting the chance which i'm so grateful for which is so crazy because i don't like america <laughs> like america to me seems like a stimulation but um i'm not gonna say too much because the government's out there we was at dinner my sister was like, I should go. And my mum was like, she calls me Boo. She's like, Boo's not going, Boo's a baby. Cause I'm a baby, like, I'm just like an innocent baby. Then like the next few days I kept thinking about it. And then I think in February I applied and then within eight days I got on the, um, on the, I guess the agency. And then from there I then found the camp I was going to when, where and what I would be teaching, which is arts and crafts, textiles and social media, which if you don't know, I did textiles in sixth, secondary school and I actually got a B. I was two marks off an A and I got a remark and I didn't get an A. So clearly it wasn't destined, it, it wasn't destined, but I should have got an A. Anywho, um, that's what I'll be doing in the US of the A. I feel like I'm moving a lot. Maybe because I feel really energised. I don't know. You guys might feel the energy in the screen. <laughs> but um, that's what I'll be doing in America. Um, if you do want a more in-depth video of like how to apply to camp. Think the steps you need to take to apply to camp. The precautions, um, I suppose. And the information, do comment. Because I'll be more than happy to um, do that for you. How am I going to do camp baking youtube and a university degree first of all my university my first no my final assignment for university for your second year year two or whatever you want to call it is due after i'm in america it's due on the day i start my work in america so i've been like running around like a headless chicken trying to complete my um uni work which has been quite stressful i was at uni today and i was like this needs to be done today because I'm leaving for America very soon and I can't be doing my uni work whilst I'm in America because I need 100% concentration on my uni work and unfortunately, well fortunately, uni comes before flying to America for a job which I suppose is a fun job but like, you know, uni first if you're going to be paying for it one day you know and to baking so i have the best job in the world i work with the most lovely people and the boss of who owns the cafe i work at she's just a babe like i did grazia magazine in january so i was out of work for about a month and i was only baking on like saturdays and it was like I was so grateful to have that type of job where I could still do my internship at a magazine whilst um, not getting fired. Because some people, if you were to be like to your boss, oh, I'm taking a month off, she'd be like, yeah, don't come back. Like, mm. I did um, actually get my boss to do my reference to go to America. And then YouTube. So I'm going to try and film as much as I can in America because I feel like there'd be so much to film like a day in my life at camp, the days off at camp, like what I do, like my journey to San Francisco. Um, I believe that once I finish camp that I will be having some family friends, family members even, meet me out in America so I probably will vlog a little bit of that and then when I come back. But um it's pretty much all sorted like uni that will be done within the next few weeks work i will be off work for a couple months and i'll come back and i'll just slot right back in like, if you want more 
of an in-depth video of like explaining how to get to camp and all that i can do that i have actually been filming like little segments over the last few months like to like build up the video i guess um so that's that's absolutely plausible but i think for now that's it that's just me explaining that i'm moving to america to california for a couple months and i'm not that excited if i'm honest i seem excited um but i feel like i'm more nervous for the journey by myself to america and like i've got lots of uni work to do before i leave so i've got to focus my uni work while I was trying to buy holiday clothes while I was trying to sort out all my paperwork and my documents that actually work in America like we don't have a social security number in the UK we have national insurance I've got to now sort all those type of stuff out I've got to sort out like um like so many things which I can explain in the Camp America video um I actually curled the ends of my hair they didn't look up rude but I can explain in the Camp America video and like yeah but that's all for now um wish me good luck i'm quite nervous but thank you so much for watching i, I think my hair looks messy but i don't know if i kind of like the natural vibes i don't know but please do like comment subscribe i appreciate all the comments and i appreciate that you guys are loving the content i'm giving like i appreciate that um but i'll see you in the next one maybe i'll see you when i'm in america which is so crazy to me um bye bye guys <laughs> like comment and subscribe and if you don't want to like comment and subscribe don't bother watch the video because that's rude